Hi everybody. So for today's video, we will be destroying five Nutcracker statues. Now the nice thing is that these statues will each spawn at a Snow Mando outpost. We do have one outpost right over here by Steamy Stacks. The second one is over here by Pleasant Park. The third one is over here by Holly Hedges right near Log Jam Woodworks. And then we have the other one right over here by Hydro 16. Uh, right there. And finally, we have the one by Caddy Corner over the, it should be, yeah, it should be this one right here. So those are where Nutcracker statues can spawn. And one of the nice things about this challenge is it is party assisted. So if you head into a squads match, as you can see here, my son destroyed one of the statues and it gave both of us the challenge. You could each spawn at a separate snow mando outpost and you could get the challenge done in less than a minute however if you don't have a squad to play with and you have to do this solo here are more locations if you don't want to bother going to a snow mando outpost now this is the snow mando outpost by hydro 16 this is a good one because it spawns three nutcracker statues you could start a game land here get the three statues hop in a plane and go to any of the other locations I'll show here in a minute and get the five done real quick. Aside from the Snow Mando Outpost by Hydro 16, Retail Row also spawns three Nutcracker statues. It's going to be in that little middle shop where the reindeer are on the roof, right inside. There's going to be one right there. There's going to be another one to your right. And then I, yeah, I ended up grabbing the chest. Boop, 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 boop. Any minute now, Chris. Okay, and there's the third one. So this is another good area. And like I was saying earlier, if you don't want to be bothered landing at the Snow Mando Outpost, either because you don't want to deal with all the people landing there, there's going to be other options. So I'll show you where all the other Nutcracker statues can spawn. We're going to land here at Caddy Corner. And we are going to steal a plane. Which one has the most feel? This one has the most feel. All right. So let's skedaddle out of here. And our first one is going to be right across on Lazy Lake. This one is going to be, there's going to be two in front of a house. And then there's going to be a single one in front of another house. So the first two, it's going to be on this first house right here on our left. This one right here. There's going to be two Nutcracker statues. You can see one, and then the other one's going to be right next to it. And then the third one is going to be on the final corner house right here on our left, right in front of us, right there. Oop, I don't know how to... And that's where the third Nutcracker statue for Lazy Lake is going to be. Next, we have Salty Towers, and this one spawns two Nutcracker statues. The first one is going to be in front of this red house right by the door, and the second is going to be in front of the door by the house with the holiday tree right here. And there it is right there. And that's the location of the second Nutcracker for Salty Towers. Next we have Pleasant Park. Now this location only spawns one and it's this house right here, right in front. And that's the Nutcracker spawn and that's the only one in this entire area. And next we have Sweaty Sands and this area spawns two Nutcracker statues. The first one is going to be right between these two houses. It's going to be right here, right under us. You can see it right there. And the second one is going to be in front of this RV on our right, right over there, right here. And that's the two statues for Sweaty Sands. And finally, we have Holly Hedges. And this one only spawns two, and it's going to be the house right over here. And they're going to spawn right in front of the garage doors, but they're already destroyed. So those are where the last two Nutcracker statues are going to be. And that's every single statue. And again, you only need five, but it just depends on how you want to do it. All right, and once you destroy the five statues, we are the proud owners of 10,000 XP and the blustery bag back bling. Look at how adorable. I do hope you found this information useful. And as always, thanks for watching.